Hey everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Warrior Land 2. Uh, this is video number 5, and we gotta defeat the giant snake. Uh, the giant snake is the boss of uh, this uh, story. Now you may ask, how can there be a boss in a game where you can't die? Well, the answer is, there can be, and it can be quite difficult And you'll, uh, for some of them, and you'll see uh, when we get to him. Now, uh, this, this this section is pretty straightforward. Uh, you can just get coins before you go there, but usually in boss levels, they're pretty short. There still is a treasure room. Every level has a treasure room, so don't forget that. But pretty short and pretty straightforward. And here is our treasure room for this uh, level. And right here you see this uh, zombie. Uh, if you hit him, his head hits you, you'll become a zombie warrior. I don't... I think I do shoot that, show that, but... um. Just off, uh, so I tell you, uh, Zombie Wario uh, cannot jump, and he will fall through anything, especially like you know those uh, flimsy floors. Um, you can pass through them as Zombie Wario from above. You can usually do it as below, but uh, he'll, his cure is light, and I think water as well. Uh, and he can he automatically kills anyone who he touches as well. Uh, and we got a glove as a treasure. So all the treasures uh, for this story. And that punch punched me into. I think it's called a punch or a puncher. One of the two. Jump back up here. I think I just want to show you um, the zombie. Or, wait, no, I want to get these coins. There we go. I may show the zombie later because I think I do go back up there. Or right now, maybe. There's really no point of Zombie Wario in this area. He's more of just for fun. Oh, I think I'm only for those coins. Or not. Oh, there we go. Yeah, see, I'm Zombie Wario. And see, I move slow. And I can pass uh, through any floors. But if I get hit by light, I become regular Wario again. Let's go through here. I'm not really sure why Captain Serb does. I guess to distract Wario, but she put a giant snake uh, in our basement or in Wario's basement. So we need to uh, go get rid of that giant snake. But first, coins. Tons of coins. Look at all those coins. And the, that skull hole signifies it's a boss room. Oh, yeah. Well, more coins first. Uh, this is how boss rooms work in uh, Warrior Land 2. Or how bosses. Uh, you get to the boss. Now, boss can't kill you, of course. You use it to hit a number of times. But, um, a boss always has, I guess, a move. And this move, such as the snake's move to eat you and turn you to a purple egg, uh, will remove you from the arena of sorts. And you have to go back through... Um, as you can see here, to the boss, and you have to start again. Now, for some bosses, that's not much of a problem. You know, it's a fairly straightforward boss. Um, so him doing that, like, like some bosses, their moves won't really affect you much, especially the next boss won't. His move is, like, really weak for uh, a boss. Um, you would think it would be a much, uh, more powerful move, but anyway, there are some moves that are really tedious, and will, if you make one mistake, will remove you right away, and you'll have to keep doing it over and over, and it can get annoying, because you can't defeat the boss, because he keeps removing you from the arena. Uh, the snake is pretty straightforward. I do get caught a few times, though, I think, like right there. So yeah, be careful with that. The snake can be really annoying. I did leave all this in because it sh doesn't take that long. Um, but yeah, this is a f really fun game, really great game, great music. I really like the music. I would love to hear some of it uh, redone, remixed for like uh, new games or new music, uh, n the new synthesizers. But uh, yeah, this snake, 
can be a pain, to put it lightly. But yeah, just watch his mouth and jump on him, and don't get eaten. Or else he'll become a purple leg. I don't really want to know what Wario's going through that, like, digestive-wise. But anyway, it's easier just to jump through here and back to the boss room. Some of them take longer to get back to, though, like, in future uh, boss fights. Jump on Snake once. Jump twice. Three times, and now he's red. Or er, wait, no. Now he's red. That means two more hits, I believe. And here we go. He's dead. We defeated the giant snake. And play the puzzle game. Make sure you have a good supply of coins because sometimes you really need them. Otherwise, you have to do it again, which you can do it again eventually. But it will, you know, it's easier just to do it now. And this is definitely a uh, six. And there we go. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this is Mega400 saying tune in next week for more of Warland 2. Adios.